then you go, this is it, the clown, here you go. And then in comes then Pennywise. Then in comes Pennywise. Um, <laughs> hi, I'm Simon Pegg. Simon Pegg. Sorry. Oh, we did a thing. <laughs> we did. I'm Rebecca Ferguson. And this is our film first. The first film I ever saw at the cinema was Sinbad and the Eye of the Tiger in 1976 at the ABC Cinema Gloucester in St. Alday Street. How old are you? Six. I want to say Titanic, but the thing is, I would have been... How old? I don't know, what are you, three? When was Titanic? Oh, that's 97. Yeah, I was born 83, so... Yeah, so you would have been about six. Is that true? <laughs> no. I would have been like 12 or 15 or something, I don't know. So you didn't go to the cinema before you were that I age? I don't remember. My mother always had me watch... Um, I watched The Third Man when I was little. That is epic. I know, and I watched The Marx Brothers. I watched things at home. Melrose Place, my favourite show in the world. The first TV show you were obsessed with was Melrose Place. Yeah. Mine was... Did you just judge that? I did, really, heavily. Mine was The Clangers. Well, why do you have to have a cool one? I think mine was because my sister was seven years older than me. Uh, and she watched it, and I didn't really understand it. Wanting to live up to the... I wanted to be in the sis. room with her and go like, oh, what's going on? The Clangers was my first. I used to shut the curtains and get on the sofa. And I think that was part of my... That's the beginning of my love of science fiction because the clangers were set on this little planet with these little pink fluffy elephants. For real. And I think, and I used to love the sense of You space. remember your youth. I remember, I remember my being born. Do you know how much therapy I've done to forget believe it? believe me. Huh? <laughs> were they puppets, the clangers? My mum? <laughs> oh, sorry. Was your mum a clanger? Was your mum a clanger? <laughs> I was born of a clanger. <laughs> oh, cl oh, well, I was a clanger. Your clanger she, she dropped a clanger. The first line I ever said in a film was something, it was a film called Tube Tales, and I said something like, no sir, you have the right ticket. It wasn't that, but it was something like that. So no, I don't remember. I think I say something like, hey, I had to arm it with Ben Yarn. Of course, I love it when you talk through it. I went to see Mission Impossible, the first Mission Impossible, at the cinema, a paying punter. And I think about that now, and I think I was sat in that cinema looking at those characters, not knowing that one day I would be part <laughs> of their lives, you know? Sitting there in the closet, giving them direction. Yeah, like... Who would have known? Luther and Ethan, you know, they were... Benji wasn't... Lethan. Lethan. Oh, that's what they... That's what they call them. That's what the showbiz papers call them. <laughs> Lethan. I, uh... Yeah, it's weird to me to think that. that I, I, I was looking at that, and I didn't know that one day I'd be there yeah. one day. I think I... I was my, my favourite loved <laughs> Too close. I love um, I loved it I loved it from the moment I saw it I think it's hard to, to remember when you last saw something on the cinema I don't know why is that age yeah um, I mean before what, the, 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 what was the one with the eye that's three oh, that's the one I was in I don't remember you but I remember uh, Seymour Hoffman very very well um, I can feel you <laughs> I can feel me judging you for not. I do. I do. Well, I didn't look like one. I did. I looked like a flipping potato in a no, cardigan. I remember you. Well, Eddie Izzard was in yours as well, no? He you? wasn't. Was he Eddie Marzan before? was. But Eddie Izzard was in his as well. He's, uh -huh. He was so. Eddie Izzard's not in Mission Impossible Three, is he? Not in Mission Impossible Three, but maybe Mission Impossible Two. He's definitely in a Mission Impossible. Oh well, I think a little trip to the IMDb can solve this. <laughs> no. My first day was the motorcycle. <laughs> The motorcycle stunt of going off the edge of the cliff. That was my first day. I got I went up there and I read I read Tom's off lines for when he pulls up and I say Go, 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 higher, higher, jump, higher. Jump, jump, jump. Yeah, you got to Let him off the cliff. And then we sat and then the afternoon we watched him do that ridiculous death defying stunt. And uh, so that's first days go, that was pretty eventful. That's a good one. Isn't it? I remember being in Venice and I had a big um, sword fighting sequence with Isai Morales. And I had just practiced the roll-up moment. Yeah. Uh, the killer thigh move. Oh, that's Ilsa's move. And I was so prepared and I was so ready for it. And it was a, it was a tricky one, even though it goes so quickly. But you have to roll and throw him and there's no lines or wires and everything. Yeah. And then they called and said the day before we're going to cancel it. There's something going on. People are wearing masks. And I was thinking, oh, oh well, it's Venice Film Festival. Well, the fe festival, of course, they're wearing yeah, it's masks. Yeah, the, it's, the, it's the thing, isn't it? Was it was so confusing. Carnival. And then I ate a lot and then, you know. And, and that, was to, the beginning that was the beginning of, of that. that. I mean, I've, I saw him be very concentrated and the, as close as he gets to nervous doing that one, just because, I mean, 
If you'll pardon the pun, there was a lot riding on it. Yeah. Get it? Definitely. It's a good pun. Uh, but watching it was a different kind of nerves because we didn't know if he was going <laughs> to survive. <laughs> I saw the behind-the-scenes footage that they cut together. They're very good at those, aren't they? They love a sizzle reel. God, they love a sizzle reel. God, they love a sizzle reel. Oh, why is it called sizzle? Because it's sizzle. It's sizzle, really? Yeah. Wow. Um, and I remember, I've seen it, I think, three times, and every time it would give me the... The heebie-jeebies. The sizzle. As someone who doesn't like heights, because you're not a heights fan. I'm not a height. I mean, I am if I'm not having to be there. I enjoy other people being there. You enjoy other people's I heights. can watch other people from their heights. You can watch other heights. I can, you know, But if she's watching own... her own heights... Mm -mm. Final question for you. You mm -hmm. kind of already answered this, maybe. I usually do. <laughs> what was the first film you watched at a young age that you definitely should not have seen at a young age? Oh, I know the answer to that. Oh. I walked into the living room and my mum was watching The Elephant Man. David Lynch's classic. And I walked past just when he was revealing. It was a profile. Just the profile. John Merrick. John, John Hurt. Yeah, but the character. Yeah, John, the John Merrick, Merrick yeah. yeah. Um, and I remember, I couldn't, I, I don't know if I'm not sleeping, but I remember feeling very uncomfortable for a very long time. My daughter is a big horror movie fan. One of the reasons is I showed her Andy Muschietti's It when she was nine. What? Well, I, I, thought, I thought it was a bit like Stranger Things. That's, you know? it was um, just that's like, like a social care issue. Well, I told Andy Muschietti about this, not name drop or anything, but I was wow. saw him at a screening and Tilly was with me and I said, hey, Tilly, this is Andy, he directed It. And... Uh, and he said, oh, you saw it, how old was she? I said, nine. And he genuinely went, what? Yeah. Like, I, and I felt bad, I felt like a bad parent. And then you go, this is it, the clown, here you go. And then it, in comes then Pennywise. Then in comes Pennywise. Um, <laughs> That's not the song. It There's is. A balloon. It's not Are the you song. doing the umbrella? No, the balloon. Okay. Uh, after that, she, after the two weeks of keep sleeping with her light on, horror madness. She loves it now. She's seen all of it. The worst ones. She mm. said, we watched Martyrs together. Do you sleep with one eye open? Yourself, because I sleep with one eye closed. <laughs> It'll be that. <laughs>